Okay. Congratulations, two wins in two. Again, you've come from behind in the match. Um, just your, your thoughts on what we've seen across the four days here? A bit different this week. Uh, initially, the pitch had been used for the international the previous Friday, uh, so it was going to be a good surface, but there was quite a lot of weather around over the weekend and we lost the toss. So, you know, I don't think I've got any qualms with any of the performance, really. It was difficult batting on day one. Um, we lost the toss and it did a fair bit. So, um, we knew that how we, how we were set up. We still, if we if we play good cricket, we could still get back into the game. We could um, maybe force a result on the last day. And to be fair, we played really really well um, all the way through the game. I know sometimes when you get bowled out on day one, it doesn't look great, but it was doing a fair bit. Yeah, your, your second innings has given you a, a fantastic opportunity there to to win it today, hasn't it? Really? Yeah, we had some good knocks. Wellesley up from with ninety eight um, built a partnership with Keaton, and then Bosch played superbly well. Bosch was playing great in in the first innings as well till he unfortunately got out. But uh, all the way down, good partnerships again. Real commitment to what we're trying to do. Uh, mentally, to come back from that deficit takes a fair lot for a team. So um, a lot of resolve shown and um, a lot of commitment to the cause. Great to see Josh back in the runs, isn't it? The last few weeks. Yeah, um, playing with freedom as well. You know, back to his natural style of play which everyone knows he's got great talent and um, striking the ball cleanly um, technically looks good but yeah I mean I'm sure he's enjoying it now. Uh, everyone kind of contributed in that second innings, didn't they? Even this, this morning with well, last night with, when, when Rob Jones came out to bat and this morning Jones and Lavelle there everyone kind of everyone's chipping in for you there. Yeah Jones he played really well last night uh, to keep the momentum of the innings and and George this morning mm. got us off to a bit of a flyer it's always tricky to know exactly when to pull out because obviously that's still a decent pitch to bat on there's a little bit in it with the um, cracks opening up uh, but a good opening partnership and and you know we didn't set a massive score I know the, the margin looks big now um, but we just felt we decided on about 300 um, with 80 odd overs and fortunately that's paid off quite well just sticking with George he kept beautifully for you there as well isn't he on the last on the last day that can't be tricky for, can't be easy for him no, I, I mean, stood up, he looked yeah. really assured. Um, did everything he needed to do, stood back, but he, he looked really good up to the stump, so uh, hopefully that will stand him in good stead as well. You, you come into today knowing you you have to win, don't you? You've got to find a way of winning the matches, there's no margin for, for errors. That comes, I guess, with its own pressure, so you must be delighted with how the team went about it today. Definitely de delighted how we went about it. I think, given the position we're in the table, we're happy with the cricket we're playing. Um, there's always a couple of games here and there where maybe you'd, you'd like to think you could have done better but generally we've had a really good season so far and all we can do is keep playing. I don't necessarily think there's no pressure on us now because really Surrey and Hampshire should should go on to win it. Now maybe the pressure's on them um, but I said after the uh, North Amps that all we're going to do is keep playing good cricket and hard cricket and make sure we win as many games as we can and keep going. 11 wickets for Tom Bailey in the match is a fantastic return for him, isn't it? Yeah, both him and Will bowled superbly throughout the game. Um, they complement each other well, but Bailey's bowled terrifically well today, and, and Will in the first innings as well. Don't often get pictures like that here. It, it, I, mean, I guess it comes with an element of risk if you're playing on a, on a, a used pitch, but is it was it a calculated decision? No, we had no choice. There's, that's the only pitch we could play on. Absolutely nothing about that. That's a, that's a good surface. The fact that it had had um, 60 overs on it three days prior means that maybe underneath it's a bit drier but still a good surface what did we we scored at four and over second dig so um, absolutely nothing wrong with the surface and you know there's no choice to it that's all we have